Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. This is Steam and Still. This is still version 1.1. I am waiting on the next patch coming out. It's supposed to be any time. It does some fixes that I would kind of like to have if I'm going to do a campaign series on it. But we're going to do another video. I made sure that I got a plugin that is large address awareness. It also works with your other mods. So this mod has a four gigabyte patch that you have to apply. I don't know if that's the same thing as large address awareness. Um, they are different sizes in their application size. So I, I'm assuming that they're different. So I added it. We're going to see what it's like. And I'm, I really want to, I do want to start a campaign with one faction. We're going to, I just want to go through a, some turns and kind of see how this mod changes the campaign dynamic difficulty, everything like that. Somebody did mention Greece and that is interesting. I have not I don't think I've played any, I, th I think one time, a long time ago, I I played, it was like Empire Total Factions or something, I think I played as Greece. I don't think I recorded it, I think I just played it on my own, but man, that was a long time ago. However, I'm, let's go ahead and do Greece. Let's just do a few turns, let's, let's just see what, let's see what this full mod has to offer. Okay, well I tried Greece and apparently that crashed um, a couple of times, so I'm, let's, let's try another one and see what, see what happens. Let's try a uh, second French Empire. Okay, dispatch for the Emperor. I can tell, ooh, a little bit more in hand. Prussia and France had a little war in the 1870s. I kind of want to dive into a faction here. Could use a, I need a general. I'm sure I'll get that in a couple more turns. Some nice units here. I'm really wanting to see a battle. Let's end the turn. One thing I did forget to mention, unless we got administrative preparation, let's do that. And we got decades of steam. Gatling guns, USS monitors, Spencer repeating carbine rifles, American Civil War. I've been really getting into a lot of good mods lately with this game. Uh, I just did another video. Actually, I think I'm gonna. I might upload this one first, but it's a ship. It's a stainless steel, another mod for stainless steel. It's really, really good. Make sure you subscribe because a lot of good videos coming. That's odd. Independent army. So. It's the German Confederation. They're not rebels. I thought they were rebels, but apparently they're not. So, let's, I guess we'll just kind of stay right there. That's interesting. We'll get some more, let's go ahead and get the farming done here. And end the turn. Look, and we also have good diplomacy here. They Both want trade. And goodbye. Here we go. It has been a nice. pleasure. Oh yes, I got me another general. Awesome. I'll take him. Yeah, I do have some colonies. So we got Algiers, which is, Really cool. Oh, we can get mines. Yes, please. That's going to take out a lot of money. And we also have down here, we have a Dakar. We got Empire. We're, we are neutral. We're not at war with them. We, I mean, wow, we could start a little war down here. We can do whatever we want. We also have Saigon. They're disillusioned, which is not cool. Uh, let's do protective staff and get them, get them going. We can... I guess we can retrain stuff. So we have some colonies, this France, that you start out with. Okay, I think one more in turn. Let's see what happens. And we get another candidate for promotion. We gotta watch our money here. Hopefully the next uh, version that they will fix some of those starting, because I know I started as Greece. I did crash every... I think I did three times. I, ca I crashed two out of the three times. So hopefully they'll, they'll have that, or add a fix to that in the next patch, which is coming anytime soon. But that'll be a neutral faction. We might just have to do us a custom battle here. Um, but let's go ahead. I'm going to start another campaign on another faction and see how different it is. Mexico. Wow. Okay, so this reminds me of something. Twelve years ago, I think. I think the first the first campaign I did, the first faction on Empire that I did, I think it was Empire Total Factions, but I did Mexico. I started as Mexico and I played through a campaign of that. So that's that's a very, that's a long time ago. So you know what? Let's give it some homage here. Let's, let's play as Mexico. All right, dispatch for the president. See, in the north, the ever-threatening shadow of the United States. Recent coup by General, uh, this guy. I'm not even gonna try it. Recommendation that we undertake a comprehensive and coordinated strategy to address these challenges and safeguard our sovereignty. Okay, so we have that. Um, one thing that I, one thing new that I have noticed with this mod is I've I've discovered another plugin that you could use for Medieval 2. It's called FreeCam. You can find that on ModDB, and 
it adds more of a fluid movement to your camera as well as rotate the camera that you cannot do usually in Medieval 2. However, I've noticed that this mod doesn't like when you start a faction and free cam is enabled or active. It kind of crashes. Also, I've noticed that the mod doesn't really like alt tabbing. I can't alt tab to do free cam while I'm on a campaign because when I try to alt tab or go back into the game, it just a black screen and it doesn't really do anything. So unfortunately, ho hopefully they'll fix that in the new patch. There is a patch coming to this anytime soon. Man, this brings back yes. so much memories of doing Empire, doing Empire Total yes. War on that Mexico campaign, the very first campaign I did on YouTube. Wow, that is a long time ago. It was my first thing that I did. Yes. So my lord. I don't really know why we're, we don't have any victory conditions yet, apparently. What am I getting? Ooh getting hit a little bit. Uh, I guess we'll just end the turn. And look, the Confederate. Well, they just had another... Yeah, this, a huge army just popped right out. Okay, well, let's just... With God's blessing and yours, we march to battle. Let's do a ram and maybe they the siege. Let's see, if, the siege. let's see if anybody attacks me. Reporting, my lord. I am so in debt. <laughs> yeah, I think it wasn't pretty much... I don't think it was a good idea to build that. That's not really going to matter because I'm still in debt. Probably because of all the troops I have, I would assume. We can look right here. Uh, let's see. Construction, recruitment, upkeep. Oh my god, it is 10k. Yes, that is probably why. You start off with a lot of units, apparently. With us, men. We'll end the turn. Oh, look. there's a th there, there it is. Central American. That's the same one. Uh, I think we need to... Yeah, I want to lift siege. We got to attack this. Let's have us a battle. Oh my god, that music's loud. Let's just take that down just a tad. There we go. Alright. I used that LAA, the Large Address Awareness. You can use them on any mod now. It's a plug-in. This is really cool. Let's get our Federal Infantry together. It just looks so enhanced. This is like a remastered Medieval 2 or something. I don't know. Looks really cool. I'm trying to think if this is this is this actually working because yeah, it seems a lot more smoother. Because I remember in the last video that I did, when you try to move these units around like this, it it gets a little weird. I've noticed that in the last video. But however, I think it the LAA might be working because it's just nice and smooth. That's the thing that I've noticed. The difference, plus the shadows and everything. It looks really, really amazing. Let's go ahead and start this battle. Oh, here we go. I forgot to do the artillery. But that's okay. They're, they're, they're back there. I probably would have put them there anyway. Let's get them to fire. Unfortunately, I don't have free cam, so I can't rotate the camera up and down. But that's okay. Looks like all this other infantry is firing. They got some killer range. I've noticed all oh, inf infantry has some. Ooh, here we go. What we got? Let's hit the cab. Uh oh, we got something going on here. Uh oh. Here we go. Oh. Oh, we got more cab charging too. Oh, hit them hard. Come on. Unfortunately, I don't have a... I don't think I have a square. We can do tight formation. Glorious heaven above. Our men have captured the enemy general. Let's try Guard him well. Give the dog some wine, and be sure he can see us defeat the rest of his army. Let's try this tight formation. Let's see what that's about. I don't see any difference, though. What better the difference if I move them? No, not really. Ooh, I got artillery too. Oh, nice. I can tell, I can totally tell the difference in, in this, in these enhancements. Ooh, that's a good hit by artillery, look at that. Ooh, nice. Let's 
mod is so cool. I'm so glad I'm doing another video. And I think, I'm, I don't know if the large address awareness is making a difference. It seems to be, to me. I mean, look at this. This is... It seems like it's a little different than the last video that I did. Which has gotten a lot of views, by the way. And I want to thank everybody for uh, subscribing. The new patch of subscribers that I've got. That, that is it's crazy. But thanks to everyone. I'm, I'm having a lot of fun. Let's get these guys a little closer. Let's, let's engage. It feels like I'm playing a, a retro empire total war or something like that. Really cool. No unit flags I've noticed. Which which suits me just fine. Yeah, you guys are firing, that's cool. Ooh. Taking some damage. That hurt. Oh, that was a that was a nice hit. See how it just went down the line like that? Oh. That is cool. Shred these. We got our zwabs here. Actually, no, these are Cazadors. And yes, I can tell that battles last a little bit longer. I played a lot of Medieval 2 mods in my day. I remember Third Age came out, um, Call of Warhammer. I remember, yeah, I even remember Stainless Steel. And I also have another video that I'm working on. I just recorded it. It's this, uh, the new S-Ship mod. It's really good. Gives it that enhanced look as well with the large address awareness. And it's a lot of fun. So, ooh, wow, I just got shredded. Look at that. Ooh, nice hit. Nice hit. And they, looks like they are, are they running? It doesn't really say. Oh, come on, you gotta shoot these guys. Ooh, nice. Ooh. This is such a good mod. Ooh, looks like, oh, come on. Shoot him in the face. This mod is amazing. I just, I, I'm having a lot of fun playing it. We might lose this battle. Looks like it. Let's go here. I kind of want to do a, a ooh, oh my god, I got hit hard. Oh my god. Oh, oh wow. I want to do another faction. Let's try somewhere else a little different. All right, we will do one more faction. You know what, I, these guys, I don't even know where they start. This is interesting. I'm kind of intrigued by this. Let's, uh, let's try this. Kind of in the area between Russia, China, Iran. Just, yeah, we're kind of, that's a, it's a different different area. That is cool. I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna do toggle underscore F-O-W. Oh my word. And look at this. Now you can see the dynamic of the whole of the whole map. You see that Britain has the usual there, but then they also have Canada. They have all of Canada. Who has Alaska? Russia. Russia has Alaska. You've got Brazil. So these are all the so the greys are usually the independent. And these guys, yeah, these are all independents. So gray, which used to be rebels, or is now the independent. We got the Qing here, and then you go down. It's Thailand. This is, this is ridiculous. Wow. I don't know if I want to leave the toggle fo fo uh, fog of war on. And we're we're not getting a lot of money, so maybe we might need to go after some of the independent Order. towns. We move sometime. Let's end the turn. Yes, we did have a crash right on that intern. That happens, though. I mean, you're gonna have that. It's always good to save your save your progress. At, usually, at the end of every turn. Also, what I noticed, you want to you want to toggle fog of war off. Toggle it back on when you end the turn. It's always a good idea. I just wanted to do another steam and steel video for you. I love this mod. A new, a new quick fix is coming. A new patch. 
uh, pretty soon. It's within, I don't know, it, it should be any time. So hopefully that'll come. I want to do some more videos on this. Uh, I do thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe. I've got some other videos happening. I found another mod as well. And it's, and it's a lot of fun. So stay tuned for that. You might as well go ahead and subscribe now. And like the video. It helps the channel. And we will see you again next time.